Hi guys, um, this is the last time, and today I'm gonna do another tutorial about Minecraft. Um, because you guys all wanted me to do one, so I thought I'd just go ahead and make a tutorial about Minecraft. Today we're going to make an update of our block script, because... Um, just wait a sec. Yep. Because basically, uh, it was, you know was not so helpful to work with, so I thought I'd just make another one. So let's just go ahead, just go to our script folder. Um, wherever I put that, um, out there. And create a new script. A JavaScript. I can just call it blocks, or something like that. The name doesn't really matter open that up and we're just going to go ahead and with starting to create some new variables we're gonna create a enum and we're gonna call this one block with a capital B and block will be equal to Um, and we're just gonna make dirt, sand, uh, stone, well, let's see what, what we else got, um, I think this has to be an equal, probably has to be equal, um, so just change that to equal. And then diamond diamond uh, iron um well that's okay for now. Just gonna save it and see if I oh just gotta be like that. Okay. Um, so be sure there's not gotta be a equal to or a double point. Just just like this. And then far, I'm gonna make a small block. With no capital B. And this one has to be equal to block dots dirt and make sure this time we write block with a capital block the capital B block, block. okay now we're gonna add the materials well, we'll just let go ahead and create all the variables for dirt and um, dirt let's just close that for a sec and open up our Damage script just showing here damage chart to damage um and just basically copy all this Ctrl C delete all this and paste it back um Let's see, you know, we also, of course, don't forget to copy the variables too. Hit points. Um, just, we don't need that, and we just change that to end. I just changed hit points to end. It's okay, and die sound. D sound, just change that into B sound. And that replacement into drop. Whoa. That rep replacement into drop. Just like that. Drop. Save that up. And make sure you go ahead and change all, everything in here too. So. 
thy sounds. You know, basically, D sound or destroy sound is the same. Doesn't really make much difference to change the name, but. I think we got it now. Um, just check if you... Okay, we skipped a couple. Just like that. And just like that. Okay. Everything is okay now. Just let's go ahead and change the variables for dirt. dirt, dirt. Um, no, oh, we don't need to do that here. Uh, create an update function. Let's create a start function. We're gonna do this in start, we don't need to let it render all the time. Just go ahead and create it in start. And you just type an if block equals to block. Um, first block is with a capital B, and the second one is just with a normal B. Um, no, I'm wrong. If block with a small d is equals to block with a capital D dot dirt, then the hit points are hit points are equal to one hundred and. Or um, we need to change the texture too, so let's create dirt um, var dirt texture sequel to material. Okay, and then we need to change it in here. So that's um, game object dot render dot material equals to dirt texture. Um. Then destroy sound, so D sound is equals to third sound. So let's just that too far. Third sound. Audio clip is equal to audio clip. Audio clip. And then we of course need to change our dirt drop into a transform. to third drop. No. Uh, basically now I have everything you need for our dirt to be dirt. Um, we might want to 
change something, want to add, you know, we ever destroy sound, but, you know, if you're in Minecraft hitting a block, it's actually already making a noise. So, you know, we of course want that too. Um, and we're gonna H sound for hit sound. Audio clip. And of course we need to change uh, dirt hit sound. For dirt hit audio clip. So now we have basically all our variables except for one and um, that is we are going to make tools so in the next or the tutorial after that I don't know which one yet but we're probably gonna do a creeper next tutorial but eventually in this tutorial series we're gonna make a tool so, which tool should we use to destroy dirt? Um, and I'm gonna do the same as up top. I'm gonna make it anium tool. Um, and we have a pick. We have a pick X. Well, it's actually spelled wrong. Pick X. We have a normal X. Oh, uh, what tools else do you have? Sort. And the shovel. I think. Yeah, shovel. I don't know if that spells right, but it will do. Um and then we're just gonna do the same thing, you know, creating a normal C tool with a capital T dot um shovel. Okay, and then now we have to Add this one to dirt as well. Add dirt. Mm. Uh, with dirt, we don't need to make a var for that. Just var. Nope. Tool equals to tool dot shovel. So, now you basically have everything you need for a dirt block. Now, of course we have other blocks and we're not gonna write everything again, so we're just gonna copy and paste it. We're gonna change this one into stone. You basically do the same with everything else, just copy this and paste it there. You have to do a lot of copy pasting. Always works for me. We're gonna basically gonna create the same variables just again. Stone. That's not good. I'm basically pr pressing Ctrl V now all the time, so that's a fast key for copy paste. Ctrl C, Ctrl V. Um, at least in Windows, of course. And then, of course, we need to change this into Big X. Um, 
And I think we basically have everything. So just go ahead and try that out. See if you don't get any errors. Nope, we don't. I'm gonna create a block. Uh, you know, it works, game object, create other cube. And put it, everything into zero. And just add a little bit of lights to our scene. Directional light. Okay, just like that. And uh, let's. Where's the script? Cube. Block. Okay, if you can see, we have all those empty variables. Um, let's. Um, let's start off with the dirt texture. You know, if I still have the dirt, yes. Dirt. Dirt sound. I'm just gonna create, take a random sound. Um, once again, just for testing purposes. I'm gonna create a lot, take random sounds and stuff. Just if you can see that it works, you know, changing the texture. Okay, and we're gonna create a. a create a new material. I wanna call this stone. And just add here the stone texture, I don't have that right now, so I'm just gonna take something grey. Add this to a cube. Place it there. Just take random stuff. You now if you have all the right sounds, just put them in there, you know, where everything works for. And just footstep. And you can see, it changes to dirt. And if we change this to stone, it'll change to stone. And then we'll have all the variables of stone and stuff to create everything. Um, just want to change something real quick. Uh, we're gonna create the little hit points of stone at 120. And we didn't do anything with the hit sound, so just take the. Hit sound and put it in here. Um, just type in audio dot play one shot because we only want it to play once, and then the name of and then just H sound, and then it will play that sound everything you hit the block every time you hit the block. So that basically is it. Um just gonna let it run again one time to see if the variables are set. If you can see all the variables are set here uh, except for that sound. Um we did something wrong. Oh yeah we forgot to add hit sound in here so let's just do that real quick. Um H sounds copy paste equals dirt hit um, and just copy that and paste it here and call this stone hit and then it will change everything to that. Now you basically have your block script. Um, next tutorial, we are going to create a creeper. And for the AI system, uh, let me know if you have pro version or free version. If you have free version, I'm gonna do a slightly different tutorial. But if you all, if all you guys have pro version, I'm gonna do something with pathfinding and stuff. This, and it will be really nice. So if you don't got pro version, just leave a comment and then I will make a free version tutorial of it. Hope you enjoyed this video, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe, like and add to your favorites. Bye.